Hi folks, I'm doing a video review on the Sergei Lang two-piece seven-foot uh, bait casting rod. Give it a try here. Yeah, the seven-foot really lets me, uh, if I want to cast with, with two hands, I can. Uh, cast a lot farther than with a uh, short little rod. Uh, the rod's pretty stiff too. So being stiff, it definitely, um, I'll show you how much play is in this thing. It definitely allows for a very strong hook set. Let me crank up this drag on this tempo reel a little bit. So it came as the rod only. I just paired it with a tempo reel just for the review here. Uh, right here, let me get a little closer to the camera. All right, so there's the bend in the rod. So it's a pretty fast tip. Uh, it's just that top quarter probably, but a lot of backbone in this uh, lower part of the, the rod for driving that hook home and the barb into the fish's jaw. So yeah, the leverage of casting out is, uh, is definitely improved with a longer rod, but still not too, too unwieldy. Uh, we have some trolling rods for trout and landlocked salmon that are like nine feet. Man, those things are just sometimes could be a bear to mess with. Um, so the stiffness of this rod also allows me to do some nice uh, side casting or pitching, which with a flimsy rod, if you've ever tried it, sometimes you wind up casting over there or there, pretty much anywhere except where you want, just because there's too much bend and flex in the rod. But uh, no, this thing is get up here and show you it has the brand name Sergei Lang they've been around since 1998 so that's 25 years it's a uh, been around for a long time they make some very nice stuff SK Hercules the uh, part number is SK-2C70MH fast action medium heavy power line weight it's designed for 10 to 20 pound mono Obviously, if you're going to use braid, you could uh, really go for some heavier braid if you want on your reel, coupled with this rod. And it's designed for lure weights between 3 8 and 1 ounce. Uh, it has an ABS reel seat. The blank goes through the handle, so there's uh, adds a lot of sensitivity, especially with braid. When you're getting a little nibble, it comes straight through the handle and you can feel it. Nice gold accent here on the butt cap. Nice cork handle for anti-slip grip even if it's wet or uh, sweaty or whatever nice trigger for some for good grip has a little line clip right here or hook clip for your uh, clip in your hook or your um, uh, snap swivel or your snap there's nine guides they're all spaced out nice and even um, they're like the just the first one has is uh i'm sorry the first two uh are uh, wound down they're the double i guess have two sides where, where it's wound and uh, covered the rest are just single but they all have uh, the nice hard lining in the guides for smooth casting uh two piece the ferrule system is nice and smooth as you can see here uh, you know where the where it goes it locks up snug but not so tight where you can't undo it just a little twist and you're good but no this is a nice rod i'll be using it for bass for uh, plugging jigging flipping uh, i'll even use this thing for uh, stripers halibut uh, landlock salmon as well as uh, river salmon. Um, I trust this rod would even work in the ocean for salmon. It's a very sturdy rod, well made. Um, I think the only thing I would like to see was maybe a aluminum reel seat, but uh, you know, with technology and everything, these ABS reel seats are a lot stronger than they they were in the past. But this is a good looking rod. Works well. Helps me cast far. Nice backbone, nice sensitive tip. Give it a try. Folks, thanks for watching. Have a great day and goodbye.